Let's first start with the Trackmaster Fall 2010 track list. Your tracks to actions and adventures, starting with the engines. These are all the single pack engines they have made. We have Phyllis Freddy, Dodge, Arthur, Scarlowe, Duncan, Stanley, Percy, Diesel, Mavis, Rusty, Thomas, Rosie, Toby, and now going into the double packs. Now, some of these packs that these single engines are holding are carrying some freight, but sometimes the majority of all of these are called as cargo cars, and these are count as coaches. But they actually have actual names, and that's what I'm actually going to call them. Uh, a Bert with a box car, Emily, Hero, Henry, Spencer, Gordon, Diesel 10 with a troublesome truck, Victor with a freight car, Molly, Thomas with a box car, James, Percy with a brake van, Salty with a freight car, Scarlo with a cattle van, Rosie with a brake van, Duck with a freight car, that actually kind of looks like Scruffy, Stanley with a tanker, Neville, Dennis with a freight car, Edward, Ben with a freight car, Arthur with a sleigh car, Diesel with a fuel tanker, Bill with a freight car, no, no, sleigh car, Dodge with an ice van, Toby with a box car, Stephanie with a troublesome truck, Renee's with a brake van, and Mavis with a brake van. Um, that's actually not correct. It's actually should be Mavis and a troublesome truck. It doesn't come with a brake van. Yeah, he didn't even fix that. I don't know why. Peter Sam with a brake van, and Rusty with a coach. Moving on to the construction vehicles, these are the same from back in 2008. Nelson, Kelly, Buster, Byron, Patrick, Oliver, but new, Max and Monty, and Jack. That's the non-motorized Jack they released in this series. Here we've got the talking engines. These are the original designs. You press the button, wait for the phrase to end, and the engine goes. There is Thomas, James, Percy, Salty, and Gordon. These are the only five they made in this type of series. With that type of function. It's the ones that do not have the annoying holes in the wheels. Right here we've got new friends and new moments. These are the three pack ones. We've got Thomas and Sleepy Sodor. Uh, that should have a red funnel, but bizarrely that doesn't on Thomas. Emily Splish Splash Splash, I do got that one. Charlie and Playtime, Bash and Dash Logging Locos, and Percy and the Sodor Search Cars. Down here are the RC engines that contains that controller, but that controller is newly programmed to have some new sounds in it. And it controls for Hero, Victor, Molly, Thomas, and Percy. Except the Percy in this one will be a smiling face. They also have Mae James and was made but then canceled Spooky Stanley. We'll explain about that in the probably in the next time. Here we got track sets. These are actually from like 2009. We'll accept that one. Uh, we got Thomas's Busy Day, Colin in the Party Surprise, Percy's Day at the Farm, and Arthur at the Copper Mine. That's a very fascinating set. That how it comes with Arthur. That's fantastic. Got expansion packs. Add to the adventure with tracks, bridges, and other accessories. We got the bridge expansion pack. I do got that one. Straight and curve track pack. Deluxe switch track pack. I do got that one as well. And the deluxe expansion track pack. Very nice. And we got the all new movie on DVD. Misty on Rescue. Which... Really was not even a good movie to say at least. It was awful. Ugh. And we got uh, trucks and tracks. I'm glad I give you some pieces of track to come with this. So, um, they give you the quarry cars, the farm and dairy cars, sort of building company, station repair cars, smelters yard cars, and sort of search and rescue cars. I really do like the detailing on each of these products. They do look fantastic. And as well, from old Misty on Rescue, we got the Shake Shake Bridge. I definitely do got that one. Uh, St. Bash and Dash. And that Zip Zoom and Logging Adventure set. 
Um, what's actually missing is the Misty Island variant of the straight and curved track pack. They did make that. And it actually includes that special bumpy track that only on the Shake Shake Bridge has. It will include that as well. And I think that's actually kind of fascinating. So yeah. Nothing much to say about this one. It's where they started from. So there. That's my quick look at the Trackmaster Fall 2010 Collector's Checklist.